Hello everybody, I'm Storm here. Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, Millennium Dawn, Vietnam. Last episode, we're continuing to advance our fronts. Uh, we're crushing India, Pakistan, you know, Tibet, Nepal, down. There's also something a little strange going on there we're going to need to clean up. Uh, that's getting cleaned up. Um... We're beginning to kind of squeeze out this little issue up there. Uh, we were able to respond to Hungary's incursion into Ukraine, so, and we've largely uh, pushed that back. So that's good. And we were able to get a naval invasion to launch. out of Cuba and into Florida. So we have our Marines in Florida. We need to grab a, a port somewhere. We're trying to build one. A few more days and we'll have a port. And once we have a port, we can get some more troops in there. The rest of the frontier in the Americas really hasn't moved all that much. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, we're also going to start planning for dealing with Japan here soon. But yeah, so far, so good. Uh, a few things we need to double check. We are still working on that. Just unpause it for just a second. Alright. We apparently have some free, or a free factory. Throw it in the transport helicopters. Let's take a look at our naval results, as I have been doing. Looks like just some convoys sunk so far. We were able to sink a whole pile of convoys by my maritime patrol and three corvettes, Portuguese it appears, three Norwegian frigates have been sunk by Brazilian carrier fighters. A lot of the naval combat has kind of died down a little bit. Sunk some more submarines. Another submarine. More submarines and convoys. That's convoys, that's convoys, convoys, and convoys. All right. Uh, how's the air war looking? We probably don't need these 300 planes over northern India. Let's move them over Pakistan. We probably
probably don't need these attack helicopters. Let's move them over. Another set of attack helicopters they can move in. planes. Let's move them over there. Let's just flood the Pakistan airspace. Okay, this is an odd little bit right here. Um, let's grab these troops. Actually, this might be better. There's all kinds of weirdness going on over here. I'm just going to be happy when all of this is cleaned up. We can reorganize these fronts a little bit. All right, how's air looking over here? Uh, we kind of do need to move these guys. Let's see, a couple of hundred air superiority fighters move there. options to place these guys.
The mod I capitulated that doesn't really matter. Tell them to retake that, please. There's no actual resistance there, so it doesn't matter. All right, Pakistan has capitulated. Like, I really don't know what's going on over here. Like, nobody should be in here. This is all inaccessible. But if we grind them out, that's fine. Uh, Guyana has capitulated? Good. The uh, Peru has done a lot of damage. That's good. All right, how are we doing over here in Florida? All right, these troops are moving. That's good. Looks like they abandoned Key West so we can take it. I don't know why we keep getting transferred to foreign armies, but whatever. Just keep assigning it to stuff so that it doesn't drive me nuts. Looks like they were trying to move troops in. Oh, that doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. I'll flip this army around. Key West. We 
How are we doing as far as our training? We only have a few more air assault brigades that need to be trained. Right, once we clean all of this up, we're going to reorganize these fronts. Alright, this army is free and available. You know, just leave it there for the moment. All right, Japan. This is... One of our next objectives here. Let's see, where would we want to do a naval invasion? You'd probably want to come in there. We'd also need to establish air superiority, which we do have. We'd need more aircraft. Four hundred. Air superiority fighters. Another couple hundred multi roll fighters. I think you hit the wrong button there. I didn't want to duplicate, I wanted to split. There we go. Oh, and I hit the wrong button again there. No problem, it actually does what I kind of wanted anyway. We just have to make the adjustments. Okay. Because the other thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want some transports. A hundred transports. And actually, probably... Couple hundred maritime patrol aircraft. And over here. A hundred more transports, I think.
So there already is a uh, transport wing there. All right, another one is fine. Because what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to grab this army of air assaults. And we're going to want them to park there and get ready. And things are really kind of chugging down right now. It's all right. We lost a submarine. That's not so great. Brazil has launched an invasion into Virginia. All right, good luck. All right, this army. I want you to contribute to the assaults. We are squeezing that down. Now we have some British troops. Okay, fine. We'll figure out what we're going to do with them later. Slowly but surely, we are collapsing this down, which is good. Which is good. Up here... I think I need to make some adjustments. They're dealing with that. All right, good. The issue is I just don't have commanders for those units right now, so... Though, what I could do... Where are you guys located? You guys are over there. It looks like we lost a division. So I could say, could I actually grab one of you, change your expeditionary forces? Okay, but I don't really want to mix those in. Okay. Much rather you keep your own troops. Oh, excuse me. Oh, yeah, gurgly. All right. Well, this is, you know, this is going to just be a matter of time before that collapses down. Uh, how is our naval coverage? Not so good. That's because most of this fleet right now is in for repairs. So is the entire fleet that I had assigned to the Gulf of Mexico is apparently in for repairs. Okay. So be it. Well, then what I might need to do is create another fleet. Have the ships. 
I definitely do have the ships. Or basically just take these reserves and make them a fleet, like these two groups of ships. Because they're kind of mostly garbage, but... They might be worth something to me. And what I want you to do is patrol the Sea of Japan. Alright, see if you can do any damage. I would really like you on aggressive. They are on aggressive. They are not. Turn them on. All right. Gambia has capitulated. Okay. More foreign expeditionary forces. Yeah, I know there's like... Naval invasions being conducted. Like, that's a potential problem, the Japanese. All right. Um, we've taken Hong Kong. All right, that's good. All right, this army. Let's unassign them from whatever they're doing, because we're going to reorganize this anyway. Let's get them down in the, into the South Pacific. Before that becomes a headache. They're in the Barren Sea? Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Well, they got a long way to go. We do need that naval superiority, though... We have air superiority. So doing a para drop would probably actually work. Well, it's an entire army of uh, paratroopers. That uh, could potentially be lost, but it wouldn't be the first time that's happened. What I need is my transport planes to be providing supply. Okay. All right, let's see what happens. Yep, 
Yep, there was someone there. Rod. And they lost almost all of their equipment in the paradrop. Ah, oh, crap. Really? Well, that's... that's unfortunate. Yep, that whole army's gone. There's nothing I can do about it. So we'll have to train up a replacement. There we go. Just when I thought I was about done with all the transport helicopters I was going to need. There we go. And we're making them as fast as we can. If they hadn't lost all their equipment, then they probably would have had a chance. So got a while to go. Oh well. But I think this is where we're going to end the episode. And so... Uh, hopefully next episode... We'll be able to work on reorganizing some of this. They are piled up over here. Have to see what we can do. Yep, we have to go through, check everybody's fronts, reorganize as needed, and uh, continue our efforts. All right, but for now, we'll stop here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.